Hey everyone, so here's a question from square and square root. Find the smallest number by which 1620 must be divided to get perfect square. So here this number is not perfect square. We have to make it perfect square by dividing with the smallest number. So for that we're going to use a prime factorization method. So first we'll start with the 2 as a factor. So we'll get uh, 2 8 is 16, then 2 1 is 2 and then 0. Again 8 10, if I divide by 2, I will get 405. Now again this will go in 3 table, so we'll take a 3 and then 1, 1 is a 3, then 3 3 is a 9, then 3 5 is a 15, 135. Again this goes in 3 table, so 3 uh, 4 is a 12, 1 is left, 15, 3 5 is a 15. Now we got 45, let me write down this on the other side. So 45 again goes in 3 table, 3 15 is, a, is 45, so 3 here, 3 1 is a 3, 1 will be left that makes a number uh, 15 so 3 5 is a 15 like that we'll get here 3 into 15 okay so once we got 15 again this goes in 3 table so 3 5 is a 15 and then 5 ones are 5 so you can see that we have got the factors here now whatever factors we got uh, by prime factorization we have to rewrite this again so, so from here we can write down 1620 is equal to take all the factors that is 2 into 2 and then 3 into 3 and then 3 into 3 and then 5 into 5 so 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 and then into 5 make sure that you don't miss out any factor once we're done we have to start pairing up pair means in a group there should be two similar factors so here you can see there's a group of two it is forming a pair there's a two pairs of three and then this phi is left alone which means that this 1620 is not a perfect square so to make it perfect square i need to remove this phi means the smallest number to be divided here will be phi because it doesn't has any pair so i want to divide on both the side with phi so on the right hand side it get cancelled on left hand side we'll get here three phi is a 15 one is left uh, then 5 2s are 10 and 2 is left so 5 4s are 20 so we get 324 if I cancel with 5 so 324 is equal to on right hand side all the factors which are left you just write down once again so this is equal to 2 into 2 then 3 into 3 and then 3 into 3 so if you observe we got exact pair of factor this means 324 is a perfect square and then we can able to find out a square root from this so when you find a square root of 324 from each uh, pair we have to take one one factor and that will be your answer so square root of 324 is equal to 2 into 3 into 3 so from each pair you take one one factor and just multiply it so 2 into 3 into 3 which will be equal to 18 so that's it it was quite simple problem i hope it's clear uh, just do prime factorization and check if any factor is uh, left alone or like if it's it's not paid up. I hope it's clear. Thank you so much for watching.